Libra, welcome to my channel and thank you for being here and for tuning in. I'm Val 333 Tarot and we're just going to jump right in here and see what's going on in regards to who you're dealing with. What are their true thoughts and feelings and intentions towards you? Keep in mind, of course, it's not going to resonate with all of you. But for more readings after this, please go ahead and check out my husband's tarot channel at Possess777. And I do offer same-day personal readings for $20. You get the same day of your purchase. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. Thank you. All right, Libra, so it looks like here it's a combination of a few things here. Either this is someone that is cheating on you or this is someone that's trying to, that doesn't feel happy or celebratory with you. It could be a friend group or just like a group around you that really is not trustworthy to be around or they could be trying to like set you up in some sort of way through groups of the, a group of people or do something here, okay? So either or, or they're just, you know, this could be someone that's just um, going back to their addictions and vices, smoking, drinking, whatever it may be here. So regardless of what it is here, I'm not sure. Sorry, I'm like, what the hell is all ratty over here? <laughs> anyway, <laughs> um, either or, it looks like here that they either don't, like they're not moving forward, there's no progression, or they just don't want to try anything of like moving forward with you in a positive, fast, healthy way, okay? So they start out pretty cool, calm, collected, and excuse me, neutral here with you, wanting to go on a new journey and take a leap of faith here with you. And it looks like it makes them not really be sure, do they want to create this opportunity with you or do they not? They're kind of stalling it so they don't know. But then they end up quickly, you know, running to you, talking to you, saying something here, signing a contract, being very fair and neutral with you, um, either or contract or just being neutral and balanced with you. It looks like there's a lot of success and recognition in a sense here with who they are, money, wealth, status, image. Um, they do well with their work in a sense, or they take accountability and responsibility of something here. And then it flips and it's a few things. Either do they not want to work with you? Do they not like collabing with you? Um, is, you know, there stuff going on in different ways through meet social media? Um, or is it like, do they, like, are they just lazy and don't want to get a job? Or are they just using you for money, wealth and everything else, right? And taking things from you. I don't know. It makes them just not either a few things like once again, just not want to work on anything with you or be greedy. Now that makes them get very defensive and guarded and kind of feel like their environment is closing in on them. It's very messy and hostile, but they don't want to get up and do anything about it. And then they end up spying, lurking, stalking, creeping, trying to get manipulative information on you. And then they don't even want to solve these problems with you. So they end up just, um, you know being in that energy of just distracting themselves basically and not getting anything done. And then they don't want to end anything with you, but they're going through a lot of pain. Now they're stressed out and freaking out and losing sleep, but they're trying their hardest to keep going. And then they're very unhappy with you or they feel like things are not positive here with you. Okay, hold on here. Okay, so that makes them want to stall and not do absolutely anything with you or work on anything with you or even like head towards you in any way, shape or form. And it looks like here, that's what causes them to have an idea here or work on something. Now, some of you could be battling for kids, maybe, I don't know, but it's like 
it's for that or maybe they all of a sudden they have a new idea they want to try something here with you whatever it may be here and then right after that is it to start shit with you to get aggressive with you fight bully you argue with you you know what i mean or are they just confused and irritated and frustrated i don't know and then it goes to are they only using you for money and just being greedy or are they just that lazy and they don't care to work hard but then clearly they have a lot of wealth and abundance and material and money and like a sense of society a community you know supporting them especially with you and through you that's where there's a lot of wealth and abundance as well so they're happy about that this could be business contracts i have no clue what the hell this is Well, it looks like here they're not willing to really make a decision and you know on what's going on and face the reality of what they're doing here with you and towards you but they still want to make things equal with you Okay, so something happened here where either they were done with you, a cycle, you know, a chapter got closed out with the two of you, or maybe you did it or life had to come in and then they still don't want to move forward and let go and get out, get over it and like actually be healthy and happy and like either move on without you or move on, move on with you. That's making them once again, just be stuck dead and stagnant and just not want to do absolutely anything once again and just be stuck and set in their ways unfortunately for some of you you could be in a marriage or relationship with them but it's very unique or you have kids well libra unfortunately looks like it makes them feel very fulfilled and happy that they're being this way here with you and towards you but now they're guarded towards you and defending and protecting themselves against you I get someone who is justifying the fact that they're a big fat fucking cheater and they already have kids with someone else but they're still connected with you in some way shape or form and who they're defending it could be a Pisces Cancer Scorpio so they want to shit on you They'll be neutral with you and they'll work with you. But then when it comes to some other random feminine, because there you are over here, like, yeah, 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 I'll try again with Libra. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, never mind. Fuck you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to defend, you know, whoever the hell on the side. It's like, okay, like, whatever, I guess. <laughs> hmm right so whatever now they're just gonna be quiet and be emotionally nice and loving and nurturing and committed to you and just stick with you because of the contract so you know and they're gonna stay quiet now they're gonna go around to someone else of spiritual or religious guidance to get information to continue figure out how they can manipulate and spin the fucking wheel over and over and over even though shit's already done with the two of you here so i'm sorry libra you're dealing with this person I'm trying to be nice, but I want to call them an ass wipe. Anyway, so whatever. Okay. Um, you could be dealing with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, mm, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, or Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Thank you. Bye.